Do you have any special talents? So I got some negative reception for the previous video that I created. I asked to why the negativity was spread and a lot of people said it was just because none of the blocks were actually secret blocks. And guess what I said? I said something so inspirational. I began. I began dreading time. You know what I said? I said, It's just a prank, bro. <laughs> so today, I'm not gonna be making this video because I'm contemplating my existence, but at least to redeem myself. I mean, if other prominent YouTubers could redeem themselves, I mean, why not? And if you say that these features are not glitches, I don't- So, without further ado, welcome back to the Holy Emerald where Emeralds will always stay green, and today, this is our first glitch that we're going to be taking a look at, and it is the button glitch. Basically, when you go close to a button, this happens. Now, I don't know if this is going to be fixed in 0.15.1 or not, but it's, it's not actually that annoying. It's actually pretty cool. It's, it's actually pretty cool, man. As you can see, third person, nothing happens. First person, uh, okay, a guy is trying to like come inside. But this is really, really nice. It, it's basically like your own private house or whatnot. The following tricks that will be showcased before you aren't actually on my server anymore. They're to all intents and purposes in single player since I don't really want to cheat on Skywalk. This next item is sort of like a sliced bread. It's chopped literally in half. As I was saying, when placing a contradicting block alongside of this glitched bed, both items destroy themselves. Yes, so this bed comes in handy especially if you want to place it next to some bedrock or diamond ores. It breaks it 100% no problem. As you can see, I can't place them. I can't place them. The next glitch block is the update block. Now the update block primarily existed back before 0.15.0 which removed update blocks. So previously, if you were to place an up like you were to place a 0. Point, let's just say 14.0 block and then downgraded your version to 0.13.0 and that block didn't actually exist back then, it would be replaced with an update block. But nowadays, that's not the case. Only 90s kids will remember the update block. Aha uh ha! -huh. Sites can be deciding. Aha uh ha! -huh. Eyes can be deceiving. Anyways, as you can see, this is like a little 2D block. And I don't I don't see how this block serves any purpose in the game. But um, if we were to place a regular item frame, okay, just a regular item frame. Let's just um, place these inside every slot. Okay, so now I'm gonna place a regular item frame on the top. Uh, there we go. And as you can see, our modified hackable item frame is actually slightly larger than the regular item frame. I'm not sure why and what purpose this serves in the game, but it's definitely a cool implementation. Our next block is actually a collision block. Now, this block doesn't really serve any purpose in the game, again, but um, it does make the ground um, darker, and uh, when you look at that, um, you can get rid of grass this way, I guess. Um, yeah, it's, it's basically a shadow block, but it's used in the technical um, section of uh, pistons. And, uh, of course, concluding our video, we're going to be looking at the redstone wire and this is not redstone dust but it acts exactly like redstone dust so um i i'm guessing that when you do place redstone dust this is what you get so thank you all for watching this amazing video hope you all enjoyed and if you guys knew all of them then i'm sorry but but there's no way that you guys knew all of them and if you guys did knew know all of them well, you're a technical wizard and I have to like literally contact you every single time that I have to make a video. With that being said, goodbye for now guys. Peace out.